But here, here's what I have to say. Because I've been processing and digesting stuff that's been going on uh, these past few days. And here's what I have to say. I think that everybody is entitled to their opinion. And I think that everybody is entitled to support whatever the f*** they want to support. And you know what? That That's on you, whatever you want to support. However, comma, I believe that no one deserves to be harassed. And no one deserves to be attacked. And no one deserves to be bullied. And no one deserves to be feel threatened. No one deserves to live in fear every day of their life. That is not right. That is not right. And I think there's a lot of positive ways to get a message across without having to make somebody feel bad. Sometimes when I think about things, I think about, is this going to make somebody feel bad? And if I find out that it does, then I don't want to do it. But everybody operates differently and everybody does different things. And that's what makes humans and society so great. That's what makes being alive so great. You have the choice. Do whatever the f*** you want to do. All I want to say is, would you want to live in fear every day of your life and be afraid to close your eyes? Would you be afraid? Do you want to be afraid to go to sleep? No. Why would you want to do that to somebody? And that goes to everyone. I think there are ways to support what you want to support in positive in positive ways unfortunately you know a lot of people feel that unless you do things in a negative way people aren't gonna respond or nothing's gonna change unfortunately that's how society has raised us it sucks because that's what that's that's how we've all been led to believe that niceness doesn't work and meanness does i just hope that in the future maybe one day people are just a little kinder to others you know what i mean i wish but you know how that goes. You know life isn't like that. You know the world isn't like that either. You catch more flays with honey than vinegar. Positive reinforcement is always better than negative reinforcement. Hey, that's very true. Listen, man. Sometimes people make choices on their own and they want to choose to do stuff. And I may not necessarily agree with certain choices that people make. But no one deserves to be harassed. Humanity is fucked up. Will I, will people say something about me? Will people say that what I said was terrible? Will I start getting angry messages? Tune in tomorrow to find out. Tune in tomorrow to find out, which is why sometimes people just don't say anything at all. You can't, you can't fault somebody for saying that they're not gonna speak on an issue and not say anything. You can't do that. At the end of the day, it's their choice. Some people can't handle stress, you know, and anxiety, and pressure, and anger. Some people just can't handle feelings. So I think it's kind of fucked up to push somebody into forcing them into dealing with something that they're not equipped to deal with without the right tools. So I'm, am I making any sense? Probably not. I'm very zooted right now. No, it's just... Listen, man. It's just sometimes I see I see some comments floating around on the Twizzlers. People are like, the silence is deafening. It's like, bruh, all right, go ahead. You say something then. Fill up the void. Say something. Sometimes, sometimes people need time. A to positive message their needs to be delivered in a positive way. It's that is not correct. possible to fight for a good cause with hate. Listen, a lot of times people rush into things and they get very emotional and and they say things or they do stuff and it's like you gotta just sit down with yourself, reflect, and think about what you're gonna say and do. And it's okay to take time off to just reflect and think. Don't rush into shit, you know? People damn think that do, stuff is so urgent. These situations, all those, it's those true. All either way, listen, sometimes either way you're gonna get crucified either way. You just need to decide which way do you want to get crucified, you know what I mean? Listen, man, I've, I've just been through a lot of shit, and I've seen a lot of shit, I've been through a lot of shit, and I just know that sometimes you just need to take a step back and relax and think. Think first, please.